Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. It's Miranda at Mrs. Thinking of a Master Plan and I am here with my weekly meal plan. And just as a reminder, this was our meal plan for last week. It was the week of October 1st through October the 7th. And we set our budget at $125 and I actually spent $135.20. So we use this lovely meal plan sheet here and this is actually from the new happy girl line um, healthy heroes so that's what we used last week and here was our grocery list and um, as you guys are well aware I do um, after I complete my meal plan I jump over to um, Walmart grocery and I place my order and then I schedule pickup for the next day or the following day um, so either Saturday or Sunday, I schedule my pickup. So this is where we were this week. Um, I ordered out, I actually went out, um, for dinner. And so this is how it looked. So this week I'm traveling for work for the new job. So whew, I'm trying to take cleansing deep breaths and doing my breathe, um, exercises on my Apple watch because a girl is stressed, guys. My stress level is at 10. Um, you know, my old job, very much so in my comfort zone. I was there for seven and a half years. And then now to embark on a new journey. So I know I've been talking about it for like the last week, but it's what's going on in my life right now. So I like to share that with you guys. Um, okay, I got like ink all over me, like right here, right here on my arm. Don't, don't pay any attention to that. So, um with this uh, weekly meal plan you guys know i love to use my colorful box of stickers and today is no different i am going to grab colorful boxes and i'm going to actually place a i'm going to grab two books i'm going to grab a newbie i'm going to grab our mini healthy hero And I'm also going to grab our colorful boxes. I'm going to cover up this where it says weekly meal plan. And last time I did it in black. And I guess this time we can do it in black as well. Unless we could do green. We could do green. It's fine. And where we just cover up this weekly. I'm going to put a little bit of white out on it. Simply because... Um, it shows through the sticker. Okay. Okay, so we will put our budget, small budget with Mr. Master Plan being here this week and also my um, brother who lives with us. Um, let's see, so this is um, October 8th and Sunday is the 14th. Let's see. So I grabbed the oh, new sticker book, Healthy Heroes Mini, and I am so excited to use it. But there were some stickers in here. And let me grab my, let me grab my handy dandy tweezers with meals in here. So I'm gonna see, can we use this? It's gonna be for dinner. All right. I don't know, but it has a meal prep sticker down here for Sunday. So I absolutely want to grab it and use it. So we have meal prep Sundays and we'll start out by placing that there. Okay. So Mr. Master Plan will pretty much have these leftovers from here. Um, and I don't know if I mentioned it before I did go over budget by $10 and 20 cents. My budget was $125 and I spent $135.20. Okay. So here, this dinner that I prep here, um, and he's not going to meal prep this week, this, this Sunday, we're not actually meal prepping. So he's going to have, um, fried chicken, yellow rice. Field peas and snaps. Okay. 
Then on Tuesday, he works Tuesday night, so he'll eat out on Tuesday. So I'm going to grab another colorful box to symbolize him eating out on Tuesday. Let me just do this. Wednesday, he will be making shepherd's pie. And yes, Mr. Um, Master Plan can cook. And he will have, um, let's see, green beans. Okay. On Thursday, Mr. Master Plan is going to have some leftovers. So let's see, I'll just grab one of these for leftovers. Friday is another eat out day and we're going to grab us a black eat out sticker. Is there a blue one? There's some blue in the house. So we'll just put this blue here. Just go colorful. Okay, and Saturday we have a reception we will be attending. Okay, and Sunday, oh, you know Sunday, I have to put the smack down. I, I have to remind him why he loves me, ladies. I have to remind the man why he loves me. So I'm going to cook some oxtails. I'm going to cook some collards. Mac and cheese. And just because we're in the South and we typically eat rice every day, rice. All right, so I'm setting that budget at $50. It may be a little bit more because of the oxtails. They're normally pretty costly per pound. So hopefully I can find it at a local, we have a local meat market here that I can certainly use. Um, so yes, that is the plan. So, and then we will be meal prepping um, the following week for the 15th through the, I believe, 22nd. Okay, so now I'll just turn on the back and I'll get my categories going on here um for my grocery list i love that this says grocery list but i absolutely have to um you know break out my my various categories like meat and produce and all that lovely lovely all those lovely things all right so we're going to be because i am trying to use up all the stickers in this colorful box this book we're going to just balance the colors back and forth so this first one is always meats. And what I typically do is I go and I look for the meats, ground beef and oxtails and sandwich meat. And then I normally put deli meat. And the reason why I'm sharing um, my grocery list this week is because it should be Pretty quick, should not take a long time for us to um, get through this. And then the next one we have is going to be this blue. And it's going to be produce. And the only produce that we need would be collards. Oh, you need, I need smoked turkey necks right here. I put turkey necks in my, um, smoked turkey necks in my collard greens. Okay, so I'm um, gonna hit this as produce. And the only thing we're going to need is collards. But I'll leave a little blank just in case Mr. Master Plan expects me to um, pick up any, um, you know, any fruit or anything that he wants for the week. All right. All right, so this is, oh, come on. Come on, booby bear. Don't do that. All right, this was so crooked, I had to bring it back up. All righty. 
All right, then the next thing that we would have would be dairy. And the only thing that I'll put under dairy is pretty much um, because we have milk, we have cereal. I can do cheese here and um, and I also put like juice, like orange juice. Okay, now we're gonna go back to orange and grab our sticker from Colorful Boxes, the last orange one. Awesome. And then I put what I just call grocery and that's all miscellaneous things. So, um, okay, I got his cheese. I need, um, uh, Mr. M Mr. Master Plan doesn't make his, um, his potatoes from scratch. So I get them instant mashed potatoes. All right, and um, we have rice. I have everything else to make collards. Oh, and why did I put green bee beas? It's an N here and an S. So he'll need some canned green beans. And he has bacon and um, potatoes and onions to put in that. Um, he wants mandarin oranges. I don't know. He's obsessed right now with mandarin orange, mandarin orange fruit cups, regular fruit cups. He likes peanut butter crackers, the Nikot peanut butter crackers, and um, Slim Jims. He likes applesauce. And I have to get him sodas. He takes them to work. I fuss at him about drinking so much sodas, but I am an enabler because I buy them for him. Um, and I need to get for mac and cheese here. Mac and cheese and then shepherd's pie. I think I'm gonna get some heavy cream too for my root. I like making my mac and cheese with a root. It is so good. Okay, so instant mashed green beans, mandarin orange, fruit cut, knee cut, slim jims, applesauce, and my husband, he's a fat kid. Okay, we have bread and I have to get him some chips. Okay. So that is my grocery list right there um for the week of october 8th through the 14th so i hope you guys have thoroughly enjoyed this meal plan um i know it's really basic i didn't use stickers i didn't really use stickers last week i'm trying to see i don't have any instant pot i don't have i don't think i have any stickers really to use but let me just grab that food sticker book real quick and just see it, it looks so plain you know it looks super super plain oh look so what I'm going to do is for Mr. Matt, Mr. Plan and his shepherd's pie because it does have potatoes. And that will be that. Um, and because that is field peas and snaps right here. I'm going to add a little snap. Oh, snap. Alrighty. And so he's having leftovers here. I'll put that there. Um, I think when we eat out, I'd like a nice juicy burger. Maybe Red Robin. That would be awesome. So we're going to put our burger here. We're going to put our fries here. Because if we go to Red Robin, I mean, we have to have the seasoned fries. And the little, the little cup, okay. And then that reception, all right.
So I am going to remind Mr. Master Plan that my food is made with love. I'll put that right there. Boom. Boo, don't don't forget where your 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 bread is buttered just because I'm going out of town, Mr. Master Plan. Hello, sir. You know. Okay, I got excited there for a minute. No, Mr. Master Plan is awesome. You'll be great when I go out of town. But otherwise, this completes our meal plan. And I did show you how I complete my grocery list with this short little list this week. And also the reminder of what our meal plan looked like last week or this current week, 10-1 to 10-7. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this meal plan. And guys, I know I have not been jumping on my bandwagon, but I'm jumping on it tonight. Make sure that you are planning out your meals. It helps you stick with your food budget, I promise you. Um, not only that, it gives your family something to look forward for two they jump on the meal planning board like when i forget to meal plan or if i don't meal plan mr master plan is like hey what's going on in here what's where where's the meal plan because he wants to know what's the plan did you plan this out i mean what, are, are we just going to go to the grocery store and just grab stuff off the the shelves willy-nilly like what are we doing here so um they come to expect it um so definitely planning uh, healthy meals for your family and things that they enjoy to eat is just another way to bring the family together and love and happiness and all that great stuff, right? So this is no different. So um, once again, 10, 8, 10, 14, budget as at $50. I'm going to jump on walmartgrocery.com and I'm going to place my order. So I hope you guys have a great and productive week. And remember, I always need you to do three things for me at the end of every video. Number one, like the video if you enjoyed the content. Number two, comment below. Let me know what your favorite part of the spread or whatever we have going on at the time with the video. Let me know what your favorite part was or if you have any questions. Um, I'll be glad to clarify, show you, whatever. I can definitely do that. And then third and um, not least, if you have not already subscribed to my channel, make sure that you hit the button below to subscribe and the little bell because that bell will give you notifications of when I upload new content. And then if you would like to ask me, you know, one-off questions and things like that, um, make sure that you're following me on Instagram. I am over there at Mrs. Thinking of a Master Plan and will love to connect with you there as well. Well, guys, you guys have a wonderful and productive week. Ciao, Bella.